What's up guys, it's Josh from Soul Studios, back with another quick Pro Tools tip video. And today we're tackling the issue in Pro Tools where you're working with MIDI and all of a sudden your track is grayed out and you don't have any sound. So let me demonstrate that for you. So this is a really simple piano track. Let's say we had the Hans Zimmer piano here. Our MIDI track looks like this, like you're used to. And let's say you're like, well, that's cool, uh, but I'd like to try a different sound. So you disable contact here. So let's say you want to try a pad sound instead. So you disable contact, you open up Diva, hit play, and there's no sound. And then you go to look, and your MIDI is now grayed out. So there is a way to reconnect MIDI, but I feel like it takes a little bit longer than this, and I want to give you the quickest way to get back to work. So what you want to do is just click on the track, shift option D if you're on a Mac, and that is going to duplicate the track. You can also do it from the menu from track duplicate. But either way, once you do that, you'll see your MIDI looks normal again. Check out the new track. have sound. So I can't explain to you why this works or why it happens in the first place, but it happens literally every time for years that I've tried to do something similar in Pro Tools. So if you're wanting to change your sound in Contact or in Diva or whatever plugin you're using, things should keep working normally. But if you switch the plugin on the track, this happens like every single time. So anyway, if you ran into this, I hope this got you back to work quickly. Before you leave, if you'll subscribe to the channel, there's many other Pro Tools tips for many other Pro Tools problems that'll get you going here, as well as a bunch of gear reviews and all things Pro Audio. So anyway, thank you for stopping by. Again, I'm Josh. This is the Soul Studios YouTube channel, and I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for your time. See you again next time.